Pop metal? <laughs> it's gold. Hey guys, how's it going? Brandon from Just Dig a VA. So with me today I have Rory. Hey. He is from Facebook and he decided to come out and dig with me today. So I'm going to let him uh, tell you a little bit about himself and where he comes from, what he's doing, all that kind of stuff. There you go. Well, I'm from the other side of the water in Williamsburg. I uh, do relic hunting and fossil hunting in my spare time when I can. I work more than I do pleasure hunt. But uh, yeah, this is what I'm here for. It's nice to make new friends. I'm in the kitty park here. And I don't know if you can see it, but it's right up top and it's ringing. 7877, so I'm not sure if that's real or not, but. No. This is not real. This is just crap. That's kind of cool. Ah, oh, there you go. I'm on the board. There you go. Huh? A dime. Not silver, but it's a dime. Those trees, look, they're just calling to me. And he said that there used to be a house over here in the aerial photos. I don't know if I should go over here, because they usually do pretty good and just try. So I'll go over here. A 1970 nickel right over here by the uh, basketball court. I think I might have just found some silver. Let's see if there's anything else in there. All right, so an earring and a modern clad dime. I'll take it. Clad dime, I'll take it. On to the next. Came over here to the sand. And I got a clad dime. Oops. There we go. There it is. Would you shut up? Shut up! Damn! Now I know what you're probably gonna say. Oh, but Brandon, it's such a small piece of gold. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. That right there is gold. Got a nickel. Can't see a date on it. It's like 1983 or 73, one of the two. Well, hmm. Another one? Yeah. Is they pop out? Oh, it's gold. It's gold. It says 10 carat right there. No. Read it. It's right there, 10 carat. It's right there on that. That's real. That's real. In the sand. Really, just laying there? No, I was. Hit, I hit a target. Is that volleyball? Is I, I don't know what it used to be. <laughs> I found gold, ladies and gentlemen. More gold. 
This beats my other little piece of gold, for sure. It says Israel. Israel, Israel 10 carat. He said that's how you know it's fake. He's full of it. Rory just went over here and he found a dime. And I came behind him. Looks like I found a dime as well. I think so. Yes, it's a dime. This is right next to where yours, I just found yours. Okay. I don't know. It's a penny, it looks like copper. Look at that. Oh, it's a necklace. Yeah. That's really cool, actually. It has an R on it. <laughs> Wait a minute. How is this ringing up? It's copper. Yeah. It's coming up as copper, but it doesn't look like copper. It's not a weedy, so I don't know. I can't get a year. But this. Yeah, I forgot my towel too. I heard that. I'm not sure. That's pretty cool, though. Oh. Little toy tractor. Hey, Rory, how's it going? Yeah, it went pretty good. Did you have fun? I did indeed. That's all that matters. Great experience. All right, let's see what you got there. Well, where do you want to start? Didn't go home empty handed. We got uh, three rare old dimes, two quarters, no silver in them. <clears throat> and then we got a whole bunch of stinking Lincolns, no Wheaties, got a little, whatever you want to call that. Hose nozzle. Yeah, hose nozzle. Half ounce sinker. And just to make God, I mean, just make me feel special. Got a little necklace pendant. And we're not real sure what that is. With my R on it. This was my first pull of the day. It is junk. It's nothing real. This one I'm not real too sure about. I know it's not real gold. The part that goes in the ear might be gold plated. Some shards of copper. What is that? Seven dimes. Six pennies. Two nickels. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yes, I found gold. I don't care how small it is, that is gold. All right, I found gold. And if that isn't enough for you. And then I found a bolt. What I thought was going to be something silver ended up just being stainless steel. And I like this thing, cool little tractor. I like it. That, I'm not sure. It's just, you know, something to hang something up or a flag. That's pretty, Now, that's probably a flag or something like that. And then, some kind of gear. I'm pretty sure it's a gear. It's, yeah. May not be. Maybe. Found it at the park in the field. Well, Rory, I think we'll try and get out and do this again sometime yes. soon. Please. Well, guys, that was our, uh, our day. This was Rory's first time digging with me. I'm sure there's going to be plenty more times. Yeah? Oh, yeah. we do it again? Of okay. course. Yeah. Um, well, plenty more people to this <laughs> Yeah, while we were out here doing the sidewalks, uh, she, she actually talked to him, so why don't you explain it? Because I, I was digging at the time. Uh, she drove up, asked me if I was a homeowner, and I told her I was not the homeowner, but these sidewalks are public property. We are free to dig on them. She said, okay, closed up her window, parked right down the street, and started calling somebody. I'm yeah. not quite sure who it was. It looked like she was calling the realtor who was selling the house that we were uh, in front of. Yeah. Or maybe she was calling the cops, but they haven't showed up yet. Um, but we, we're not doing anything illegal. Um, we're doing everything by the book. We made sure. So if you're going to metal detect, please do it legally. Okay? When you do it illegally, you give the rest of us a bad name, and then they start shutting us down. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up subscribe and hit that bell so you get notified every time I put up a video. Alright guys, well this has been Rory and Brandon.
from Just Dig It VA.